Hello, I'm making this video just to show you how you can uh, change the bin number or width in a histogram in Excel for Mac. Um, it was something difficult. I was uh, as assigned to do this, uh, like a homework about creating a histogram. You know, histogram is a type of graph that you can use to represent some data. For example, here I have some test scores. Um, from students from 90, I mean, uh, some students take uh, took this course getting from 30 to 94, 95 was the best one. And I wanted to create a histogram of that. So I just go, I just select the, the data, the numbers and then insert, and then we go to histogram. And we create a histogram. But here's the thing, Excel just give us this kind of histogram with just three bins. So, and he, and the problem was that at the time of changing that, it was very difficult on Excel for Mac users. You can do it on Excel for Windows. It's pretty easy. You just go, you just double click on the, on the X axis or the horizontal axis, and then you will find those options. But on Excel uh, for Mac, it's very difficult. You will never do it if you do that if you do it that way. What you need to do is you can um do anti-click on this data on this data and sometimes you said like right click, right? So you get you you give a right click on the data, I mean on the graph, you you do the right click and then you will see those options. And there's an option almost at the bottom. It says format data series. You click on that and bingo, you have the option for bins. And that is something interesting. You click on bins and then it's on automatically, it, it just show you three bins, but you can change that. For example, I can I will change the number of bins uh, from three to seven. And as you can see, the data starts changing or the how the graph looks changes. And I can then change the width of the bin. In this case, I will choose 10. And as you can see, the data looks better. You can see or you can analyze the graph in a better way changing the bins. Again, please. Don't do the way you do it on a Windows option or for a Windows, Excel for Windows, because it's completely different. You need to go on the data and do a right click and choose the option, option format data series, and then you will have the options for the bins. Bin width, uh, the number of bins, you can change that. I can put an eight, graph will look different, but I will choose just seven. And you can do the same for the, you know, the being with it. That's it. I hope this video helps you. Uh, I found it interesting. Maybe you want to do that. So that is the way you can do it. Thank you.